Um, but then, so this was a double bill that we went to. Oh. So after the room, uh, we, we went and queued back up outside. We got back in. Um, I got another picture with Tommy and Greg. So the first time I had Jack come in with the picture, and the second time I had Cat come in for the picture. Okay. Um, then they did another Q and A, and this was because we were about to go and see their follow up movie called Best Friends. Wait, what? Yep. <laughs> Does this exist? Yep, they're releasing a new film. They, no, is... they're releasing it. It's not like out yep. yet. It's it, no. We saw a test screening of it. So Whoa, we didn't fuck, really I'm see so a final jealous. version. Yeah. Wow. Honestly. So again, the Q and A and everything was still just brilliant. Yeah. But it was really weird seeing. So after seeing a film like The Room with a load of people who had clearly seen it before and were just enjoying themselves, to then see a film that no one had seen before but coming off of the high of watching The Room because right. like The Room probably finished like an hour before we started watching this. Yes. No one really knew what to expect, and right, well, this is no spoilers. So I have to be careful what I say, but it, it honestly, the opening like couple of minutes is just genuinely beautiful and you're like oh that they've actually tried and that because i was worried that they just tried it's like a real movie room they've tried to do a real Mm -hmm. movie and it's good well Well, so okay they've tried to do a real movie (laughs) that's the key yeah it's so upsetting because the beginning of it like liam said it's, it's genuinely beautiful it's really well shot this whole opening sequence is like I was like, "Oh man, we're actually they've like they've done it. Yeah. They've made a good after accidentally making the room. They've actually made like this decent movie." Because Greg wrote this movie, that's worth pointing out. And also, like yeah. the audience were like laughing at, at bits at the beginning that weren't that funny. And I think it was just because they were still on the like the high of the room. Yeah, yeah. Um, People were expecting a room esque film, and this film was not this, that. No. It's like sort of serious. Yeah. Okay. Like, okay, so I don't this is a spoiler because this is how they've been selling the movie, even though the way they're selling it doesn't actually happen until like <laughs> the last twenty minutes of the film. Okay. But the 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 like one line pitch, uh so Greg was asked to describe this movie and he said it's about a time that he and Tommy went on a road trip and he thought Tommy was gonna kill him. Huh. No 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 Tommy thought Greg was gonna kill him. Oh is that did I get it the wrong way around? Yeah. Yeah, right. He said that he said Tommy thought that I was going to kill him. Got oh, you. Wow. Okay. Okay. So wow. Which is weird because they're supposedly great friends. They're best friends. Best friends. Hence, hence the title of the film, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, right. So I I want to say before you guys get your hopes up that you know they've done another film. Uh, when we left, I I said to Liam, "How long was that? I feel like we were in there for three hours." Uh, the film is an hour and a half long, I believe. No, I think I think <laughs> and... I think the time on IMDb is wrong. I think it's more like nearly two hours. Oh, okay. So it was a little bit longer, yeah. but honestly, it's not. It, they don't get to the room level of cock up, and that they sucks. don't achieve a good film. Right. So it's like, oh, uh, it's the I worst. Was Those are the worst. The in between ones where it's like it's not bad enough that yeah. it's fun, but it's not good enough that it's real. Yeah. Here's, Damn. here's the thing. That's what it was like. like for both me. Jack and Cat came out and were just really just like fed up and like I didn't like that. I kind of enjoyed it. <laughs> okay. And okay. Well, I think I, think, I feel like, like you have more of a history with Tommy Wiseau than them. Potentially, maybe. the thing is, yeah, no, it, I mean, it feels like yeah. they've tried to genuinely make a film, and the one mistake they've made in this, it's, it's just a small mistake. It could have really, it real easily been rectified, but they've cast Tommy Wiseau in it, <laughs> and that's the problem. Yeah. Because it's like you, they've got an actual director, it, they've got like cinematography. Oh, like, they like Greg Sestero is actually acting. And then any time Tommy Wiseau comes onto the scene, it's it's like they just can't control him, and he just dominates the scene and just takes it in whatever direction he wants. Uh, and that's yeah. when it kind of sometimes it's like there are bits when I I can't tell you now if they were deliberately trying to be funny or if that's just the way it played out because of Tommy. Yeah, because because Greg is legitimately like an all right actor, like. Yeah, it's not like, great or anything, even in like, like, it, he's not bad. He, like he's like the only yeah, actor exactly, that's, like, yeah. that's like somewhat believable. You know what I mean? Like yeah. Yeah. he's trying to be an actor in the movie. Yeah, like, exactly. I, yeah. I, I, and I think see he could him... have done it if his life hadn't been ruined by the room. Yeah, <laughs> I could see him getting like a job on like a daytime soap or something and being perfectly fine in that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, agree. Yeah, um, I'm looking at it right now on IMDb. I like that it's classified as comedy and thriller, which is not two genres that normally go together. <laughs> no. The, the other thing is, um, the last, like, five minutes is just bonkers insane, and I fucking loved it. I can't say what happens, because it's spoilers. Yeah, yeah, don't, don't. But, but yeah. it's just, yeah, yeah. It, it just, ah, oh, it takes a turn, and it's just amazing. Was that the bit where me and Kat thought it had finished? Yeah. 
got you. Yeah, I know exactly. You what think you're it's about, finished, okay. and then and then it just gives you gold. It really. I mean, does. that was it was the opening and the ending were the two best bits of that film. Okay. Yeah, cool. you guys both felt like the majority of it was a bit of a slog, and equally, like like I said, like the fact that we'd been told that it was this road movie and it was about this like incident. The fact that they don't actually do that until the last twenty minutes, you then got like an hour and a half waiting for it, which is odd. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but. I had a lot more fun than I think most other people in the theatre did. And it might just be because I had more of a history with them. It might just be because this was more up my street with the way that they were kind of mixing uh, tones. Uh But it it honestly is just, it's great until Tommy comes in and just often derails the movie completely. And you're like, I don't know where we are now with this. Do you you think that this is going to have a life of its own, like the room? Like, are people going to have screenings of this and find things to throw at the screen instead of plastic spoons and stuff? I don't think so. I don't so. think so. No. Um, but equally, like, like I said, we did see a test screening, so it could be that they're, st- they're going to make some changes to it. Okay. Gotcha. I just looked at IMDb at the uh, release dates, and it's playing somewhere here at Beyond Fest yes, at the end of is. September. Um, I'm going to a film festival down in Texas next week, and there's a secret screening. There's, there might be more than one secret screening, but like, if they get them to come, like that, I would, I would love to see this movie next week, just like as a surprise. Like, I oh, want to see yeah. this now. You would have to tell us what you think of it because I will. I, absolutely. I, yeah, I need to speak to people about this movie because um, I just want to get as many opinions as possible. Because it doesn't look like it's actually coming out like for real until sometime next year, and I don't know when that's going to be. I guess they're going to try to sort of make it better who knows yeah. <laughs> yeah i think it'll be interesting to see what they do to it like yeah. whether they make any drastic changes or not um but yeah it, it, it really is a sort of thing where it's, you don't know what to expect and it, it, it whatever you're going to go and expect it probably will do something different to what you're expecting <laughs> perfect so i gave it three and a half out of five i'm not sure what you did jack i think it's probably a 2.5 like pretty much spot on in the middle i don't i don't really know yeah mm. fair enough 